looking at the Lilliput HT10S monitor. This has a 10.1 inch LCD display with a brightness of 1500 nits. Contrast ratio of 1000 to 1. The HT10S has both HDMI 2.0 input and output and also a 3G SDI input and output. It can be powered with the included AC wall adapter with threaded locks or you can attach the included NP-F battery plate. The monitor also has a 8 volt output for powering other devices. The HT10S has built-in speakers and also a headphone port for monitoring audio. Below the headphone port there is a LANC port for compatible cameras. The bottom and both sides have quarter 20 for mounting and on the top you'll find three buttons labeled touch, input, and FN. The touch button will power on and off the monitor and can also be used to lock the touch screen. The input button will select between SDI and HDMI and the FN button can be used as a shortcut button and is set to peaking by default. The HT10S is touch screen making going through the menus very simple. A swipe down in the middle of the screen will pull up your menus. From there, you can tap each icon to go through the settings and function of the monitor. By swiping up or down on the left side is a shortcut to adjust the brightness. And if you swipe up or down on the right side, it will control the volume. You can also pinch to zoom and move around, which is super helpful for dialing in focus. The HT10S has a lot of built-in features, like waveforms, vector scope, histogram, peaking, false color, overexposure, safety markers, aspect ratios, level meters, and more. You can also use the USB port on the back to load your own LUTs. In the box, you have a sunshade, an HDMI to micro HDMI cable, an NP-F battery plate adapter, an AC wall charger, a LAMP cable, an NP-F battery plate, a ball head, and a USB thumb drive. 